Hi, everybody. I'm Jim Nance of CBS Sports, and I'd like to welcome all of you from the NCAA Men's Golf Championship Site Selection Committee to this very special video. I do hope to express my feeling and the feelings of everyone at Duke University about the golfing facilities at Duke University Golf Club and how that site is tailor-made for the NCAA Men's Golf Championship. This site has every amenity imaginable and also answers every host site requirement established by the NCAA. Located at the apex of North Carolina's famous Research Triangle area, only 13 miles from the Raleigh-Durham International Airport, easily accessible by Interstate Highway, with an abundance of convenient and affordable top-quality hotels, Durham is home to Duke University and its spectacular Washington Duke Inn and Golf Club. On the edge of the Duke University campus, the golf shop is housed in this four-diamond hotel. Directly adjacent to the inn is the redesigned and newly improved Duke Golf Course. Duke University Golf Club was recognized by Golf Digest as the fifth best new resort golf course in the United States for 1995, as well as one of the top courses in the state of North Carolina. The original Robert Trent Jones design typifies the Piedmont of North Carolina, with streams meandering through a variety of hardwoods, towering pines and beautiful shrubbery, its playability is as classic as this state's golf tradition. The routing of the course emphasizes Trent Jones' guiding principle. Create the illusion that the golf holes were on the ground just lying there, waiting to be grassed over. Opened for play in 1957, the course was immediately labeled one of the top university facilities in the country. And in 1962, it attracted the NCAA Golf Championships. Ironically, one of the players in that contest, Reese Jones from Yale, was to make a bigger impact in another role in Durham some 30 years later. When we redid the course uh, two years ago, we took all the classic elements of my father's original layout. You have the natural features of the streams, the topography, is sensational. In fact, the trees are so much better than they were when I played here in the NCAAs because they frame the holes. You know, to some degree, I almost look at this golf course as a an Augusta National type golf course that everybody can play. Renowned for his work on behalf of the USGA in renovating several U.S. Open venues such as Brookline, Hazeltine, Baltus Roll, and Congressional. Reese Jones has defined a new standard for what he calls definition in design. We have a sequence of holes, 11, 12, and 13, that really aren't power holes, but they're finesse holes, and they're as good as any holes you'll see in combination, uh, five, three, four, on any golf course. Since reopening, the new layout has already hosted regional qualifying for the 1995 Men's U.S. Open Championship and the U.S. Women's Amateur. Over the next several years, Duke Golf Club will host several major golf events for the Carolinas, and it has also been approached to host national amateur events. The golf course is the annual host of the Duke Children's Classic Celebrity Tournament, which brings in a field of 360 players over the course of two days to enjoy this Jones creation. This event alone has succeeded in raising more than $8 million for pediatric research at the internationally recognized Duke University Medical Center. The golf facilities at Duke Golf Club are managed by resident PGA master professional Ed Ibargwin. Ed, in 1995, received a prestigious National PGA Award. He leads a superb golf staff, which includes four PGA golf professionals, Duke's golf instruction program and practice facilities were featured in PGA Magazine as one of the finest in the nation. At Duke Golf Club, the primary emphasis is on customer service with a firm commitment to excellence in every phase of the operation. For example, the club, through quarterly visits, works closely with the USGA Greens Section Turf Advisory Service in an ongoing effort to provide every player with immaculate playing conditions. When the Duke course reopened in April 1994, it was the culmination of a meticulously planned five-year rejuvenation charted by Duke University Vice President and Athletic Director Tom Butters. 
With the major construction now complete, systems are in place to provide the same attention to quality and detail and maintenance from an amply funded annual budget of nearly $2 million. A good many of you in this room are well aware of my long association with Duke University, my love for golf, and my care and concern for the NCAA and its championships. That's why it's kind of ironic that they're all coming together at the same time at this moment. We are pleased as a university to request your consideration of your championships being held at Duke University in the near future. I can promise you that this golf course, the quality of its maintenance, the quality of the accommodations for players and teams and press will not be surpassed any place in the country. That is our commitment to you. Along with the challenge of the course itself, the club boasts an expansive and convenient practice area featuring target greens, multiple grass teeing areas, and short game facilities. As you know, the practice facility is a critical part of a successful championship puzzle. When it comes to a hassle-free environment with practice greens, bunkers, teeing ground, unlimited first quality golf balls, Duke takes a back seat to no one. The Washington Duke Inn, Durham's top deluxe hotel, affords a myriad of tournament options for the media, as well as all required meeting and office spaces, and a four diamond food service. The Duke University room is ideal for smaller conferences or meetings. The Ambassador Ballroom can host functions for up to 500 people, but has the flexibility to break down into seven separate rooms as needed. The Inn has 171 classically appointed rooms and offers additional overflow support from the Sheridan and Hilton hotels located just minutes away. In addition, more than 5,000 guest rooms in a wide range of hotels are available within just a short driving distance. Ultimately, the Duke Golf Course will provide the opportunity for championship excitement and fireworks as the last groups come down the stretch. And then the finish here with 16, 17, 18 uh, will really test the mettle of uh, the best players in the game. So in essence, I think it'll be just like a lot of the U.S. Open golf courses that uh, we remodeled and prepared uh, for the national championship. Uh, I think it's going to be a golf course that people are going to leave and say that they got what they deserved, and I think that's what should be done in an NCAA championship. Duke University looks forward to the opportunity to provide the NCAA with a first-class site to host its men's golf championship. The unique combination of location and quality of both the tournament hotel and golf course in an area of the country synonymous with golf tradition offers an unparalleled venue worthy of your championship event. Duke University, having hosted NCAA championships in many sports, has the utmost respect for the stature of collegiate championship athletics. These championships offer the fondest memories that players, coaches, and fans will ever have the opportunity to hold. The NCAA Men's Golf Championship held at the Duke University facility will deliver a tournament that players, coaches, and fans will talk about for decades. I'm not sure we can ask for better than that. Thank you.